<laughs> just a quick tip, a quick tip. You see this um, design here? I hear something really you wouldn't have even, um, something you wouldn't have guessed, you wouldn't have ever thought of. It's what I used here for this design. But what you see, I actually did this. It's funny though. You see, I used a ring for the background, just something really simple. A blood background and then I added um, a ring. Yeah, this is what you saw there. You see, in making your background, instead of making it plain, you just want to, you know, touch it up. Yeah, it's, that, it works for me, actually. I don't know about others, but I can use um, some design elements. For example, now you see I'm using a ring and I often blow them to have like that blurry effect. Yeah. Instead of just using the plane. And you see, I just use it. But you don't just place um, um, those elements wherever you want to. You have to actually um, do it with uh, something else as uh, a reference. For example, what I did here in this case was I uh, used this, the images here. You see, I didn't just place the ring wherever I just felt like, you no. Know, so if you're adding elements to a background for example these so but i didn't just want to use it like this so i thought of adding um this to it so, so this is just even you know very um minimal if it's um something else if it's if i can use even much more for depending on the concept and the background i'm working with and another reason i use this is because i wanted to use it as a light as a light source for the flare I'll be adding this I use on um, a flare here so the the ring actually was used as um, a light source and so for adding lens flare to your design you actually need um, a light source so, so it works well a light source for example white yeah but in this case I use the gold ring to because if you just add on a light source, sorry, a lens without a light source, it may not come out well. So I said I uh, that one is quite simple, but um, like I just use um, the ring. I said in others, I can use multiple. For example, this guy right here, you can see the background manipulation and all. So as you can see, this is it here. You can see the design element I use and I and I said um, if you you blow I blow this um, ornament you get but you can try it um, without blowing it first and see if it works but it's best you blow them so look at it and and another key thing you should know is that I said you of yours they should not tell that oh for example, you, if I didn't tell you that I use a ring, you wouldn't have thought of it. Like I said earlier in the video, I use a traffic light for this. Now you don't wouldn't have guessed it was a traffic light. So it is important. It's important you place the ornaments and blend them with your design, and not just um transparent um ornament. You can even use background. I used on um, a background here as well. I use a background. This. There's um the first background and I added this um this um a uh, light background as well before I added other things like um the flash um sorry the traffic light and you can see all of them here so like look at it clearly and yeah, now traffic light so these were important um and you can help your design now if you want uh, more explanation on these kindly comment. Um, can you leave it on, in the comment section and let me know? That's it. So I really hope you get um, this tip I just shared with you. So it can make your design um, backgrounds pop, look more better you get.